In this tutorial, we're diving into Canva's text-to-video AI tool that makes video creation easier than ever. We'll show you how to access the tool, where you can write the prompts in order to create the video, and I'll show you different video, camera, and lens styles in order to make the best videos possible. But before we start with the tutorial, if you're new here, make sure to subscribe to AppTutor for more similar videos like this one. So without wasting your time, let's start right away. Open the Canva homepage, and then I'm gonna start by opening a blank video design since we're gonna be generating AI videos. Select a format which you need and wait for your blank design to open in Canva. In order to start generating videos, we'll be using an app called Magic Media. So go over to this Apps section. Then scroll a bit down until you see the Magic Media app and click on it to open it. Select the Video section right here, and you can now start writing your prompts. You will have a certain number of credits which you'll use in order to generate these videos. And if you're using Canva Pro, you will have around 50 credits, which is enough for 50 video creations. If you don't have Canva Pro, I'll leave a link in the description where you can sign up for a free trial where you'll be able to use Canva Pro for a month for free. Now you can click on the Inspire Me option right here in order to generate a sample prompt. But if you don't want to do that, just type whatever you want to create a video about. Let's say I need a nature video. I'll type a nature scene with mountains, rivers, trees, and animals. And then I'll click on the Generate Video option down here. Our job now is to wait a minute or two until Canva generates our AI video. And if you're happy with how the video looks like, just click on it once and it will be added to your design. As you can see, Canva generated the video just as I described it. The next step is to describe a video style in order to enhance our generated video. We can add different keywords in the prompt in order to describe the video better and get a better result. Some of the keywords which we can add are cinematic, slow motion, time lapse, realistic, and many more. You can use ChatGPT in order to get high quality and detailed prompts which you can use with this video generator. And these prompts should give you better results. I'm gonna type something like, show me a city in the 1980s. Make the shot cinematic. And when the video generation is finished, you can see that it indeed gave me a cinematic city shot. So add the keywords like slow motion, time lapse, cinematic and similar in order to get the video style which you need. Another thing is to add camera movements to our video. I'm going to ask ChatGPT once again what kind of camera movements I can add. And you can see that it gave me a list of words. We can add a drone shot, an aerial shot, a tilt, and many more. So I'll add a drone shot of a forest near the seaside. And let's see what kind of video it's going to generate. As you can see, the video looks pretty good. So just describe the camera movement which you need, and then let Canva do its thing. And the last thing that you can do if you want to enhance your prompts and generate good looking videos using Canva's AI is to add a lens description. For example, if you need a close up shot, you can write close up or macro shot and then describe what you want to make the video about. ChatGPT gave me a list of some keywords which I can add to the prompts. And you can write something like a close up shot of a butterfly on a flower. Wait a minute or two and then your video will be created. You can see that the video looks great, and it only took us a minute to generate it with Canva's AI tools. Tell me in the comments down below if this worked for you, and if you have other video ideas which you want me to cover, please leave them in the comments section, and I will see you in the next video.